Hi guys, if it's your first time watching Two Boxes, um, we are a photography company but we're also about style and image. Um, and what we do is we do all the finishing touches to all photo shoots, um, we make sure you look really, really great. But this channel is mainly about looking good and it's helping you guys that don't come to a photo shoot and it's just helping you guys in everyday life, whether or not, um, whatever age you are, it's about styling, etc. Today's video um, is a, about my derma roller and I thought I'd get on and actually just film um, my routine of actually how I do my derma roller. This is my everyday routine, so this is my morning and evening routine. This is basically what I do, no matter what serums I use. So whether I'm using kind of like my new skin products, if I'm using my Clarins products, I tend to use this morning and night, and this is my derma roller 0.25 um, routine. Now what I do, I basically will take all my makeup off, um, even morning and night as well, so I find that even if I've woken up in the morning, I do my cleanse, tone and moisturise routine, but every step of it, um, obviously I cleanse and tone, and then when I'm basically putting on my serums and my moisturisers, I use my derma roller. And I start off with basically going up and down, um, up and down my face. I'll do my sort of my crow's feet just here. I will go across my forehead. So it's basically, you just roll it across your face in sort of like gliding motions. You can put a bit of pressure on it so you can actually feel the mi minute little tiny needles. I will then basically go over all of my face, I will go up the sides and all over and if you imagine if it's if you've ever been for a facial and somebody's basically um, putting creams on your skin, I always do them in an, like an upward motion as well. So basically when I roll up I'll put a little bit more pressure going up so it's giving it a little bit of kind of a little bit more of a massage. I will go around my eyes. Um, I will do my eyes very very gently and I go um, down the sides of my um, by my sort of like my crow feet and like my laughter lines I hate calling them crow feet they're not crow feet they are happy lines they're laughter lines and if you've got them be proud that you've got them because you're a happy person um, and then I will basically go down my neck very slightly and also I will do across my decollete because you have got to remember your neck ladies as you get a bit older um, it is very important that you don't um, neglect your neck. You can also do the back of your hands with your serums and you can do with your derma roller. You can actually do anywhere on your body that you've got, say if you've got a little tiny bit of pigmentation or you've got some scarring or if you've got like a little tiny bit of cellulite, um, it does help the appearance of the, the superficial skin on the top of, um, of the, the, the layer so your your dermis your subcutaneous layer is like the fatty tissue but your dermis is the top layer it will actually help with that so you can do this all over your skin I tend to do this for around two to five minutes depending on um, kind of how I feel my skin is if I feel like it's my skin has been sort of ravaged a bit and I've been a bit outside and I'm looking a bit more kind of cold and dry I tend to do it a little time a bit more um, but that is basically a really, really easy routine that just have your derma roller in your bathroom, buy your serums and buy your, um, you know, buy your moisturiser and everything, just leave it out with it and that will remind you to use it every day. The only thing I would say is every time you've used it, wash it under a hot tap and if you can, get yourself some, um, some ibuprofen or alcohol. It's, um, it's salon, I use it if I'm spraying any of my tools or anything. Um, just to basically keep it clean, just have that as well, so you can um, you can make sure it's clean. Sort of like a couple of you know, once in the morning, once in the evening, put it back in its case, and then yeah, just use it. Now, as I said in my previous video, you will it won't just happen instantly. You will need to give this time because your skin is renewing itself, and the cells from the basal layer up to the top it takes about 28 days. So from the day from day one you start using it, your skin is going to feel look it's going to look plump and it was going to look it's going to be a bit glowy because it's going to obviously you're going to have a thing called erythema, which the blood flow is going to flow up to the surface of the skin, and you are going to look a little bit sort of rosy, which is great it's not a problem it's not damaging it's really good it means the blood flow is flowing up and you're getting collagen to those you know those cells and it will wake the cells up as well because as we get older our cells lie a little, a little bit more dormant and they need a bit of a kick up the backside um so i do that three um 
I do this every day of the week, morning and night, and then I three times a week I will basically use a slightly higher grade needle, so I'll use a 0.5, and then once a week I will use a 1 or a 1.5. Um, 1.5 is fairly hardcore, I wouldn't go any higher than a 1.5, and when you if you buy a 1.5, you are gonna go, holy crap, this is basically, this is quite sharp, be very, very careful with the higher grades. Your 0.25, I suggest you start with, and that's the one that I basically use every single day. If you're really scared about derma rolling, don't go over 0.50. Um, so anything other than that, still go to your salon, still have your treatments done. I'm not dissing um, salons and people that do electrical treatments. It's the fact that I find this for myself keeps my skin looking incredible. I'm 45 in a few weeks time, March 17th as it is, and everyone always says to me that my skin always looks really, really great, and that's kind of one of my little secrets. I don't go to salons, I, I do everything at home. Um, giving away all my secrets, um, come back, come back for more styling secrets, and I will see you guys in my next video. Hope you've actually enjoyed this. Make sure you Go and check out social media links, follow us, and hit subscribe and share. I'll see you later. Bye.